in this video you will learn that how to make weather station and also you can call it weather monitoring system for this so you have to use some kind of sensor here i'm using the rain sensor and it's added uh, as an external library this is 20 cross 4 lcd module this is arduino uno and this is dht 11 temperature and humidity sensor this is light sensor and this is air moisture sensor and uh, here i have used the potential meter as a mo air moisture sensor because proteus doesn't have the air moisture sensor so i'm using the potential meter as a moisture sensor it's working will be that uh, it will measure the temperature with the help of this um, sensor and also the humidity with the help of uh, dht 11 as well it will sense the light uh, its unit is lux and with the help of uh, this sensor also it will measure the air moisture with the help of uh, this sensor this rain sensor is used to detect the rain so it's time to write a code for it so here you can see the code this is the uh, lcd library lcd pins and for that you must have the external library and this should be added to your arduino ide software if you don't have you can download this dht library from the link provided in the description you can see here it's this this library is attached below you can found the link and you can download from there also the circuit diagram the uh, code and the range sensor library for protest as well you can download all these files from the link provided in the description and uh, here you can see that uh, the dht sensor is connected with n art similarly here you can see the lcd and uh, this will sense the temperature here it will sense the humidity and here it will sense the light intensity with the help of this uh, it will sense the air moisture and here it will detect the rain let me decrease this delay so let verify and run the code now copy the hex address hex file address from here first you should to add the dht library if you don't have it will not work so how you can add just click on sketch then library include library add zip file and then go there where your dht library is available on your pc so in my case here you can see so i will open it but as i already have so it's saying that uh, the library named this uh, already exists but in your case it will be added so run it and now copy the hex file address from here press ctrl c now click on it and paste the hex file address here remove the previous values click on ok also you have to add the library to this as well so right click on it and the library and hex file can be downloaded from the link provided in the description so rain sensor library for protease open it and here you can see the hex file for this rain sensor so open it and then click on ok so let me zoom it to a specific area so 
so now run the simulation here you can see let me explain the things the DHT sensor is connected with N art you can see here wirelessly connected if you don't know how to connect the pins wirelessly you can watch the video link is provided in the description and from there you can learn that how to connect wirelessly pins in Proteus the LED sensor is connected with N art and moisture sensor is connected with A2 similarly the rain sensor is connected with a digital pin 2 of the Arduino you can see here and the LCD is connected with the pins from 8 to 13 so now let's zoom it to a specific area now run the simulation so here you can see the uh, name weather station then here you can see the TM temperature HM is humidity AM is uh, air moisture it's in percentage it's in degree Celsius it's uh, also in percentage light LI light intensity is 27 lux and here you can see the state of the rain sensor so it's saying that no rain so let's change the temperature and humidity so first I'm changing the value of uh, humidity and you can see here the changes as well here you can see let me decrease it now let's change the temperature you can see here now let me change the air moisture you can see here now let me change the light intensity you can see here it's 27 so let me increase it you can see here and now let decrease it you can see here now let me change the state of the rain so if this means zero means no rain whenever this will be one uh, in other words you can see that if the pin goes high so it will say that oh, it's raining so let me change the state of the rain sensor and here you can see it's saying on the LCD that raining and and in this way you can monitor the weather of any desired location the circuit diagram libraries and code can be downloaded from the link provided in the description if you like the project please subscribe my channel also like and share the video thanks for watching